Hey guys, it's me. I'm back. I'm not going to be in the video today, but I did want to share what will be in my hospital bag for the delivery. Um, I'm going to be making a video about the updates on everything that's going on and why I haven't been recording. So, But this is just my hospital bag um, video, so here we go. Since I don't wear a lot of makeup, I'm just going to bring a small thing of eyeshadow that I like to use. I think a mascara, a little brush, and some eyeliner. Nail polish to, I guess, spiffy up my toes. Then two different lip balms. One is just petroleum jelly. One has a red tint because it's cherry. And a mirror. Um, some floss, deodorant, toothbrush, of course. A toothpaste, a body wash. I managed to get powder in this little container. So, baby powder, two things of lotion, one for me, one for my mom that's coming with me. Yay, exciting. And then mouthwash, q tips. And in here is a fingernail file for me, tweezers, and a little thing of roll-on perfume that I like um there's a bar of soap a bar of dial soap I think it's um peach or something like that then I'm gonna take my stool softeners that was prescribed my prenatals that were prescribed and two days worth of my Lovenox shots with a few alcohol pads I'm also taking baby wipes for my face because my face gets really greasy and I it really drives me crazy. So a little tiny pack of um, baby wipes. And then I know they're going to have these. And I'm probably not going to use these. But I went and got the overnight super duper huge pads. And I got four in here. And then I have my um, nipple pads. The Nook ones. They look really, really big, but they're not that big, I guess. But I packed four because, like I said, I'm going to be there for a while, which I'll explain in another video. Then I have one pair of underwear to go home in, which I still probably won't use, but going to have anyway. One pair of socks to come home in. These are like tube top shirts or whatever. I just use them for my boobs because my boobs are really big and sometimes I don't want to wear a bra and I feel like it's going to be really easy to do skin on skin after the baby gets there. So I'll wear those probably while I'm having the baby and after. Then I have two long uh, maxi dresses that one is turquoise and I don't want to open it all the way up but it's really loose and comfortable and easy to breastfeed in or if they need to check anything you can lift it right up then this one is a tube top maxi dress and it's really long so I probably won't wear this much but like walking around the hospital or something because I get really hot so I don't think I'm gonna have a problem being cold in the hospital and then I have a huge towel that I'm going to use because definitely not about to use a hospital towel then for my going home outfit, I just have a pair, a really big pair of sweats and a white t-shirt. And all of that is going to go in this Nike bag. It's a Nike duffel bag that I have found when I was moving. And then toiletries and stuff will go in this Nike golf bag. <laughs> it's not a toiletry bag, but a toiletry bag wasn't big enough for all the stuff that I'm gonna have to bring so that's my hospital bag video and I will be back later to make a video on the update of my pregnancy all right guys